Top 5 Scary Ghost Videos Caught on Camera The Intruder The first video comes from the TikTok page All Day Every Day The uploader's wife had been hearing noises around the house late at night On the inside and outside And her husband didn't really believe her at first until one night He woke up to some creepy noises inside his house and decided to check it out. Watch closely. What is that noise? The door to the attic can be seen banging on its own, but when he goes up to check inside, he finds nobody there. On another night they are disturbed once again, when they hear banging and other noises coming from one of the sheds outside, so he gets his phone out and decides to record. What he captured is enough to give anyone the chills. Something is banging around and making noise in one of our sheds. I'm not really sure what to expect. I'm gonna go check it out. What looks like a creepy figure can be seen inside the shed, quickly running out through the back, and then again escaping outside. A few days later comes another night, and his wife hears something around 2am outside, and upon going to investigate, he captures true terror. 2am, the wife just woke up, said she thought someone was playing in her back shed. I hope not, because it's almost falling apart, it wouldn't be very safe, but I'm going to come out here and have a look around, see if any of the neighborhood kids are messing around or anything. Let me get quiet here for a second. looks like a person can be seen just hiding at the top of the barn, however we can't see any light reflecting off the face, and it appears to be just all black. Although we can see some of the fabric from the clothes, one glance was enough to make the recorder run straight back home without hesitation. So could this be a real intruder trespassing on someone's property, or is it just a simple ruse? You judge lurking nearby popular urban explorer chris from the youtube channel urbex hill has recently ventured to an abandoned school to explore all by himself now at first not much happens but after a while he starts to get the feeling that he is constantly being watched and eventually things get creepier and creepier after he captures this. Do you hear that? Oh shit. Somebody 
easier. It appears that someone else is also wandering the building in the dark and after noticing, Chris quickly hides in a corner and turns off his light. If that wasn't chilling enough, he then decides to continue down a different route to avoid this supposed person and that's when he then has a face-to-face -face encounter with something. Take a look. Hello. <gasps> what the fuck? Oh, it's a fucking toy. Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. That scared the hell out of me. Excuse my language. Heart is racing. I thought it was a, a person standing there. That's fucked up. Why would somebody leave that in here? Make sure nobody's actually in here. Get that thing, man. That is creepy. A terrifying looking mannequin toy was just left waiting in the bathroom, and it seems to fall over the moment Chris gets startled by it. It may not seem like much, but that brief moment where you lay eyes on it after turning a corner can make your heart skip a beat, wondering if something or someone is going to charge straight into you. Shortly after, Chris heads into one of the offices and notices something utterly terrifying watching him. Safe is still here. I wonder what's in it. Oh shit! <gasps> shit. Fuck. Where the fuck did he go? Hello. What the fuck? Where did he go?
A sudden sound can be heard and then when he looks up to check, we see what looked like a black figure quickly moving out of view and disappearing. But when he goes to check, we can see that it's a dead end and there is nowhere to run or hide. Yet upon checking, he finds nothing there leaving him creeped out and baffled at the same time. So he then decides it's time to leave before things get too out of hand. And just as he reaches the staircase to the exit, he hears something disturbing once again. Hello? What the fuck? Okay, I know I heard somebody coming down these stairs. I'm out. The sounds of footsteps coming down the stairs can be heard approaching Chris. But as he calls out, the sound completely stops. And when he goes upstairs to have a look, there's nobody there. Just what do you think is going on? Is this place really haunted? Or is there a real intruder lurking around and hiding? Let me know down below. Doppelganger The next video comes from the YouTube channel The Hooker who has been featured on the channel previously. It all started one day when he had just gotten out of the shower and he heard some knocking coming from the front door and it turns out that when he opened it there was nobody there but he must have unknowingly welcomed an unseen force inside his house because from that day onwards he began to experience more and more creepy activity within his house and negative events seem to happen around him more frequently as if he now attracts it just recently, one of his family members passed away and his health has been slowly deteriorating as he notices constant weight loss, headaches and buzzing sounds in his ear. One day, while recording around the house, he captures this. God, this fucking thing is... It's not, well, I guess it is a window too. God dang, that thing is fucking filthy. Hello? Hello? Oh, oh Jesus. It's my letter. On the next night, something similar would be captured on camera. Am I hearing things? Fun. Fun. David. It's not fucking funny, guys. After searching the whole house on multiple occasions, he found nothing. But the ring camera set up inside his sister's bedroom would then send an alert to her boyfriend's phone that motion has been detected inside their room, as you can see from the flashing phone light. Upon reviewing the footage, something chilling can be seen. Take a look. It might be hard to see at first, but when the phone light flashes, 
we can see what looks like a dark mass quickly dive under the bed as if it was trying not to alert the sleeping couple after the light started flashing the mass can also be seen in the mirror reflection at the back although it's hard to say if this particular occurrence is paranormal or just something caused by the light flashing but then again that wouldn't explain the motion alert that set the ring camera off in the first place. What do you guys think? Anyway, on another day he hears some strange noises coming from all over the house. So he decides to mount his phone in one place while he goes to look around each room. And that's when the camera captures something disturbing. Watch closely. A tall dark shadow figure can be seen just walking across the room from left to right and just seconds after we can see the hooker coming from the room on the right but he's in front of that other room where the shadow walked past and as we can see when he is walking back inside the path doesn't connect to the other side it goes straight out to the garage so it couldn't have been himself Later on his nose starts bleeding out of nowhere and a creepy sound can be heard. Oh, what the fuck? God. Fucking nose bleeding. This is weird. That's fucking nose bleeding. That's fucking weird. Fun. Fun. I actually pushed stop on my stupid fucking camera. And I forgot to turn it sideways, so yeah. So that was gonna be weird. Anyways. Uh, fun. I know they're not here. Fun. Hold on a second. Hold on. Okay. Sorry. I have to put on some pants. Fun. Right when he starts bleeding, a sudden bang can be heard at the door, but when he goes to check, there's nobody there. Now things get even weirder from here, because similarly to Wade, who he featured recently, this guy also woke up and noticed a strange notification on his phone of a picture taken of himself sleeping around 4.24 a.m. Watch. All right, so this is the picture that I came across. In my photos, my Google photos, kind of look like fucking shit. That's not the important part about this. The important part about this is I didn't take this fucking picture. Look what time it was. 4.24 a.m. 4.24 a.m. I was asleep. In fact, that night, the second I hit my bed, I passed the fuck out. My little lamp is on, 
and my eyes are halfway open. So like, <sighs> dude, look at my fucking eyes. The fuck? No way, dude. That's just fucking weird. That is so fucking weird. Dude, that's not me. At least it wasn't me that took the fucking picture. There's no way. His eyes appear to be open in this photo, which may make some people question it. However, he does seem to look like he is drunk or in a lifeless trance kind of state. Many viewers are suggesting he has a doppelganger entity attached to him, which could be responsible for the creepy photo. A few weeks later, he discovers a strange little box with a cross on it. And shortly after, he is left with chills. Fuck, dude. Fuck this shit, dude. I'm out of here, dude. After a while of waiting, he believes something is inside the room, and when he gets closer, things get even worse. Come on. Really? God damn. Hello? Hello? My fucking camera's not on. This is on the infrared thing. I don't know if that's a real person or whatever. I look like a fucking real person to me. If you're in my house, you need to get out. Hello? Hello? You can find the seat under my door. Fear here, the cops are on their way. Fuck this. I'll walk. He was so freaked out that he just up and left the house to go for a walk. And his sister and her boyfriend have said that they will no longer be returning. And he is now left on his own to fend for himself and deal with this torment. Not alone. Reddit user Scorpio Astellium posted a strange video to Reddit. They say they have had some strange things happen around the house for a while that they couldn't explain. But after setting up a camera and recording himself sleeping for a few nights, Gavin eventually captured some spine chilling footage. So, okay. so here I am. You can't see me, but you, you'll see me soon. We just I'm evaluated right pretty much the whole video. He goes, his head is from the left, and then feet My are feet down are towards there. the right. Right. Um, 
I'm, yeah, my head's over here, my feet's right here. And so if you, if you stay for a second, you'll see right here. Okay, whoop, uh, rewind it, bring that back. And, and then see, can it just we... whoops right up. Ready? Watch right here, watch right here. Whoa, okay, Jesus, so that's already am. creepy. Yeah, so there I am. That's right already there. creepy. Right there, but just, we're like, maybe scared. that's Gavin. Not me. He somehow, he somehow got up. There I am. No, no, no. Ready, ready, ready. There I am. That's supposed to be me, right? We skip a little bit, right? Uh, yeah, uh, ready? And then it just goes like... It yeets ready? back out of existence. There's my head right there. You can see me moving. And as soon as I move... Yeets back And you see how as soon down. as I moved... As you can see, Gavin is sleeping with his head on the left and his body going down to the right. And suddenly the covers just shoot up as if something is there with him. But the moment he shows a slight sign of movement, it just dives down and vanishes on the spot. They do seem quite excited as if they actually captured something, which kind of makes it seem genuine. However, since this is a recording of a recording, and not the raw footage, it's hard to say what exactly is going on. With that being said, I'll let you judge. Be aware in the woods. The last video comes from the TikTok user TT Swaggy, and in the video she happens to be out in the woods when she caught a glimpse of something creepy. So she started recording, and this is what she captured. I could have sworn I seen somebody run through these woods just now. I live in a country, not too many people know about this back here, but I'm telling you, I could have sworn I saw somebody. Oh my goodness. Hey, Zach. I could have sworn. See, Zach, there is, yeah. some, there is a man over there. What? I'm not even playing. A strange humanoid looking creature can be seen lurking behind the tree. It looks like it's gray, and one viewer suggested it's an owl while many others say it's a skinwalker. What do you think? The final judgment is yours to make. That's all for today guys, but if you like this video, subscribe and hit that bell icon so that you never miss an upload. And with that being said, you can follow the original Depths of Despair on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. See you next time guys.